with rust or paint, which masks the material defects, as shown in the sectional view. Therefore, the first step is always the pre-cleaning of the test piece surface. This must be done very thoroughly, so that any defects present, here it is a crack, are open to the surface. In the second step, the penetrant is applied to the test piece, usually a red-coloured low-viscosity oil. Due to the penetrant's high surface wetting capability, it penetrates into the defects and cracks. After several minutes of dwell time, the third step is to rinse the part's surface cautiously with water. The water removes the penetrant completely from the surface, but leaves it in the crack. Now, the fourth step. After drying the test piece, a developer is applied onto the surface. The developer is a fine-grained white powder suspended in a liquid. It forms an even coating on the surface. After drying, it draws penetrant from the crack out onto the surface. The location of the crack is indicated clearly on the surface. 